In New Zealand, breast cancer is the first leading cancer in women, plus over 70% of women are dying of breast cancer. But nowadays, it's even attacking our younger generations. The common treatment through intravenous injection of any cancer drug, but it often leads to many side effects. And plus, who would like to have a needle poke into your skin? Therefore, um, the oral chemotherapy have better benefit because it's got better patient compliance and also it has got more effective and low cost. But however, it's very difficult as well. Therefore, well, you can't just imagine swallow the pills and the drug target to the tumor directly, right? So my PhD aimed to develop a novel nanoparticle for oral delivery of anti-cancer drug to treat breast cancer effectively. Now let's see how it works. First, I encapsulate these anti-cancer drugs inside a nanoparticles and then encapsulate it with uh, outer coating. And this outer coating can protect the nanoparticle from our stomach acid and digest the enzyme. And this outer coating can also bind to the goblet cell on our intestine and enhance the permeation across our intestine. So over the time, this nanoparticle can actually reach the stomach circulation. And then the outer coating is degraded and leaving the inner nanoparticles to circulate around. And then over the time, this nanoparticle can accumulate at our cancer site, release the drug, and cure the cancer. Well, as you can look at our bottom figures, is the animal study of the mice of the tumor. And we give them orally the drug solution and also our oral formulations of our nanoparticles. And after three weeks, you can see our drug-loaded nanoparticles significantly inhibit the tumor growth compared to the drug solution without any formulations. Now, if you look back to my title, you probably understand why I call them smart pros. Well, under the microscope, they look just like the beautiful white pros, and they're smart because they can overcome all the intestinal barrier and then target to the tumor effectively. As we know, if you need to win a war, you need to have some powerful weapons. And this nanoparticle show promising anti-cancer effects and also target to the tumor effectively. I believe in the future, the common use of nanoparticles will be not be a dream. Thank you very much. <laughs>